Hi everyone, it's Gary Nicholson here for weatherweb.net. It's the fast forecast for your next few days. Now for Friday, low pressure across the country and a tangle of fronts dragging their way northwards during the day. Looks to the heaviest and most persistent rain across North England and eastern Scotland in the first half of the day and really may persist in eastern Scotland well on into the afternoon. The rain across Wales though will gradually break up and fade into just a few areas of showers and the breeze freshening from the northwest, allowing much cooler, fresher air to spread in from Ireland, brighter skies developing all the while. Across central and eastern areas, after a really misty, murky start with bits and pieces of rain around, one or two areas of uh, sharp thunderstorms may just break out into the afternoon, although very hit and miss in nature. Still rather warm and humid, temperatures around 25-26 in eastern England, at highs just nearer to 16s and 17s across northern areas, and feeling unpleasantly cool where that rain is persistent. Now all that clears away into Saturday and uh, many areas then are going to be dry during the day. Early cloud and mist breaking up into some sunny spells during the daytime. One or two areas of showers may just skirt across western Scotland during Saturday. Uh, temperatures here at around 16s and 17s towards the east, around 21-22 out across southeastern England and much uh, less humid than on previous days. The breeze from the west at around 10 miles per hour. Best any sunshine I think across eastern areas by the afternoon. Now, not too much going on on Sunday. Many places dry and bright with some sunshine around. Temperatures around 21 in the south to around 17 in the north after a rather cool start to the morning. Clouds may just begin to thicken from the southwest as these fronts try and push in. Maybe a few spits and spots of rain here, but many places staying dry throughout the course of the day. And that's the fast forecast. Thank you for watching weatherweb.net and bye for now.